You won't believe that this creamy, deliciously satisfying soup is actually vegan. To make this soup, you will need vegan chicken strips. I'll be using a full bag from Gardein, minus the sweet sauce, which tastes amazing over some rice and vegetables later. I used one and a half tubes of Pillsbury croissant rolls for the dumplings in this video. Now everybody has their own preferability. Some people prefer a little more chicken, some people prefer a little more dumplings. Just use whatever feels right to you. Half of a not chicken boiling cube, one full carton of no chicken broth, one and a half cups of almond or other dairy-free milk alternative, plus three fourths for the thickener. A half cup of cashews, a half teaspoon of poultry seasoning, and yes, it is vegan, a half teaspoon of black pepper, a half stick of Earth Balance vegan butter, and a fourth cup of flour. To begin, remove the frozen chicken strips from the bag and set it aside to thaw out a little. Next, break apart the croissant rolls into very small pieces. They will get a little bigger as they cook and lay them on a cookie sheet or large plate. And we're just gonna place them in the refrigerator for now. All right, now back to the chicken strips. You want to chop them into the perfect size, not too small and not too large. Now in a high speed blender, add the cashews, half of the not chicken boiling cube, and one cup of hot water. Blend till smooth and creamy. In a large pot, combine the no chicken broth, all of the cashew mixture, the poultry seasoning, and pepper. I was supposed to add the one and a half cups of milk here, but I added it later and it still came out just as good. Give that a good stir and bring it to a full boil. When it reaches the boil, add in the half stick of butter and lower the heat to simmer. Now, like I said, I was supposed to add in the milk earlier, but mistakes happen. It just took me a little longer for my soup to return back to a simmer. No big deal. So when your butter is dissolved and your soup returns to a simmer, start dropping in the biscuits and taking a few breaks to stir. Now to give this soup some thickness, in a small bowl whisk together a fourth cup of flour and three quarters vegan milk. And pour it right into the soup. Stir together, then add in the chicken, stir again, cover, and boil for 20 minutes on the lowest heat setting. If you have any leftover croissants, and I have to admit, I did get one extra tube for this purpose. Roll them and shape them into cinnabuns on a cookie tray, sprinkle with cinnamon sugar, and bake following the directions on the package. And because you can't have cinnabuns without that frosty glaze, in a large bowl, crumple one tablespoon vegan butter with some powdered sugar and a very small amount of dairy-free milk. And with a hand mixer, blend well. The more sugar you add, the thicker the frosting will be. And lastly, a dab of vanilla extract. Now you've got yourself a full meal. And doesn't it look good? 